Let's game, bitches. Oh, the G3 convention has now started. I remember we were making our new game engine. Don't mess up. Oh yeah, that was our uh, simulation for the uh, our government simulation game, which was pretty fucking cool. We had 2,900. We didn't get into 100 boots. There's not really any point in reading that if we don't make it into the 100 boots. It's like, meh. Yeah, we did it, but nothing really cool about it. Look at that research. Now we can actually research some shit instead of I mean, shit on a stick will be pretty good for an RPG game. Seems that the market is normalized again with no popular strong trends at the moment. Alright, that's cool. Our new game engine, Shit on a Stick, or SOAS, SOS, is now complete. Alright, let's, uh... Develop a sequel. We got that new engine. What was it to? We, uh, what was our last... Um... Uh... We, we had a, uh, it was a Slash and Shit Chronicles. That's what we'll do. We'll make Slash and Shit 2. We'll make it the SS, S Slash and Shit Chronicles 2. Slash it up. A medium mature medieval RPG game for the PC. Using the shit on a stick. Alright, we will use graphics V 3D graphics V2. It's gonna be an awesome game, I can feel it. I can fucking feel it in my bones. Stories and quests, yes. Gameplay and engine. We want do we want engine? No, we want gameplay a little bit more, but stories and quests are that's what we need. Needs a branching story. Uh, yeah, that'll work. Vagisil for gameplay. Stories and quests. Bill Bright. And uh, you, you do tech of the engine, Spencer. You spence it up. SSC number two slash it up. It's gonna be awesome. This game is gonna be fucking awesome. It's just a, just a sequel to the first Slash and Shit Chronicles games. We need dialogue, not much AI. Dialogue tree, better AI and AI companions. Level design, meh. But uh, dialogues, we will uh, we'll throw Heather in on that. Spencer, you do artificial intelligence. And Vagisil, you get in on level design. Which world design will be way more important. World design will be where it's at. Look at that, our design is already through the fucking roof on this game. We're not even in phase three. We may hit triple digits on design. We won't, we won't hit triple digits. Okay, we need graphic and sound, but world design needs to be way up. You are our main design specialist. Bill, go for graphics. Actually, Heather's not our design specialist, I am. So Bill will go there and Spencer will go there. We will need to there we go. Now, shit. Heather's gonna be over. I mean, Vagisil's gonna be overworked. Fuck it, Vagisil. We'll try to trade you out with Bill. Put Vagisil there. There we go! We fucking got it! We'll try to make those even, but world design is where it's gonna be at. Look at that. The fucking design of this game is just. It's, it's new age. It's cutting edge. This is like the Oculus Rift whenever the PlayStation 2 is coming out. That's how awesome this is. This fucking game. Jesus. Today, the new game platform Inbox by Micronoft has been released. Fuck you, Micronoft. Look at us. Look at what we've done. Fuck. Fucking Christ. We are awesome. Vagisil, just over her team, has just commanded them into a new age. Due to increasing experience, fallen staff has earned a raise. Bill Bright. Yeah, we get it, Bill. You did good. Advanced cutscenes and rich backstory. Which means... You can research. Uh, we need th uh, better graphics. So we have 23. I think we can research two new topics. <gasps> Easter eggs, actually. Or rich backstory. Rich backstory is a good one. We got eight. So you generate game report. 
for SSC2. The first reviews for SSC2 slash it up came in. Dude. A masterpiece by Star Games. Very good by Inform Gamer. Inform Gamer, you cut us you cut us a little cheap there. They achieve great balance between technology and design. Hell yeah, we did Game Hero. Love it by all games. All games, you cut us short too. Cut us a little short there. It's fucked up. All kinds of fucked up. Shits and Giggles have recently released a sequel to their game Slash and Shit Chronicles. The newest game in the series titled SSC2 Slash It Up was met with great responsing. Sponsors. Critics praised that SSC2 Slash It Up had a newer engine than the original, really driving technical innovation. You're fucking right. We fucking rocked that game. You. We're gonna train you. What do you got? You got your design. You need to get a little bit of technology, but still work on your design. So I think... Do we have one that's more designed, but also technology? Eh. We'll just do a game jam for you. Look at this. Look at this. We're owning in the markets right now. Ladies and gentlemen, the surprise hit of the year is SSC2 Slash It Up by Shits and Giggles. The attention to detail in the world design really get, sets the game apart from other others in the, in the genre. SSC2 Slash It Up really deserves the top spots in the charts. Fucking right we do. Our post-release analysis for SSC2 Slash It Up is complete. Uh, gameplay seems to be quite important for this type of game. Okay, I didn't know that before. But now I know. You. Vacation. You. Train. Spencer was my... He was technology, yeah. So we'll do a code jam for you. Dude, can I not start fucking code jam? What the fuck? Can I not train you also? Train. I don't have the research points. Fuck. I am not a smart man. You. Uh. Fuck. New research available. Achievements. We'll we'll start in on that with our next game. Come on. We we need to make one more game. Come on. You got this. You fucking got this. But right, you. You need to go on a vacation. You. We'll just wait. Well, actually, while you're on vacation, we will find contract work doing library software. This will be so easy. Just look at that. Look at that. We'll we will we'll have this done soon. There we go. Nice job. 20k into the account. Okay. Okay, he's back. We will uh. Uh, let's see. Let's develop another sequel to, uh, where is it at? It's, it's, we're going to do an old game. It's going to be, uh, where is it? Shit Sims. We're going to do Shit Sims. We'll call this Shit Sims 2. It's going to be a medium game for everybody. It's going to be a life simulation for the, uh, this one. Yeah, we'll still go with the PC. The engine. Shit on a stick. Do we want to be PC, though? I think that the Shit Sims 2 should be for something that everybody will play. More like the uh, inbox. Yeah, we'll get it. Just We want to develop something for the inbox. 3D Graphics V2, that works. Just fucking look at that. Look at those bubbles already. <sighs> engine, yes. Stories and quests, no. Branching story. I mean, does there even need to be a story? There doesn't even need to be a story. We need simple cutscenes. Engine and multiplayer. Yeah. So you can play with your friends and make a house. Better user experience and character progression. Yes. You want to be able for your character to go through life. I think that works. I think that works pretty well. I think that's going to be awesome for us. That's going to work well. The fucking bubbles are already coming out. Ugh. Makes me feel good. Hi, this is Jorg Longer from Game Nova. I got word that Shits and Googles is working on a new game. Would you be willing to share some information on your current game project and do an interview about it? Agree. What is your expectation regarding success of Shits and 2? We'll hype this shit. We need the hype. Thank you for your time. Because we've been developing hit games. We can't sell ourselves short. Never sell yourself short. Okay, level design. Dialogues? No. They're just going to speak in what we call shittish. AI? Eh. There we go. Yeah, that works. Fuck yeah, there it is. Vagisil will have to be off the last part though, because she's not she's not up to it. Uh, SSC2 is off the market. It sold four four hundred thirty one thousand five hundred twenty units, generating four million seven hundred forty six thousand eight hundred three in sales. 
Look at the fucking bubbles. Just uh, feel it in my blood. The fucking bubbles pumping through me. That was awkward. I should probably shut up. Sound. We need sound. Graphics not as much. World design no graphic, but we need sound. Rich backstory. Uh, Heather, actually, we'll get Bill in here. I think the world design would be design. Heather, you're more design than techish. We need to actually train you on that, but we'll throw you in there. Magisil, we'll trade you out for Spencer. I think. Yeah. We'll lower your ass down. There we go. Everybody will be fucking. We got you in there good. It's clear. There's a clear trend toward adventure games recently. Nice. But we're currently working on our life simulation. We don't care about the trends. We're, we're paving our way through the game industry. Large booth. We'll fucking hype this shit up. Boss, it's way too hot in our office. And our, yeah, fuck it. I don't care about our money. We got one million. Almost even. The hype is real. Four, three, two, one. There we go. Look at that. 97 design, 77 technology. New records all around. It's gonna be a fucking hit. Because everyone loves the shit sims. Due to increased experience following staff to earn a raise. Heather, you are, deserve that raise. Special training available for you. New research mini games. Alright. Fuck it. Just get our shit out there. First reviews for our new release game, Shit Sims 2, came in. Good game. Star games. Good. We don't need it to be anything less than sixes. Beautiful. My informed gamer. Very good, my game hero. Yes, game hero. We love you. Great game by all games. All games now started to love us. Like fucking, oh yeah, shit sims too. I think this is where we're gonna leave. Wait, no. Check out our G3 booth first. I see you people showing up, being like, oh shit some giggles. They're making shit some game. It's fucking hype as shit though. It's fucking awesome. We're not in the top 100 though. Yep, see. But uh, yeah, I think this is where we're gonna leave off. Thanks for watching. It's been Narl for Loco, and until next time, wait. Uh, the survey announcement Vena has confirmed that discontinuity of the Dream Vast Vena's president said that it, while many companies will still deliver games for the platform, the company will no longer produce new units in the future. All right, Vena fans worldwide were disappointed as the loved part of gaming console history is coming to an end. Yep, we get it. All right, but that's been uh, Game Dev Tycoon. We'll talk to y'all later. Oh fuck! I'm trying to end the level, the not level video here. An exclusive interview a while ago about still system blah blah blah. Bold remarks confirming the, the, the they are then in development system 2 predicting that it will be uber successful now the game is out on the market. The system of Agile system was spot on. The game received very positive reviews. Overall this has positive effect on sales. Hell yeah it did. We'll talk to y'all later. See you later. Bye.